Hello, this video is about uh, how to take your build from Xcode and distribute it to your team members for testing purpose. So first of all, you need to check over here is you need to go to the Xcode, open Xcode and uh, go to this uh, left top section. You can find the project name over here. Click that and from there you can find the general sign and capabilities, all these things. Uh, in general, there will be a version and a build. So if you're taking the build or for the next build, you need to type the version as well. So what I mean, I'm having here like 2.8. So I'm going to change that 2.9 version and the build number will be 9. Actually, every time you, it will be incremented. And go to the sign-in capabilities where you can find the bundle identifier and also the professional profile. You need to add that to the Xcode. How you can do this, you need to take from the Apple developer account. And from there, you can create a certificate and also the professional profile. So here I have my professional profile and the certificate already being implemented. So I'm going to the next step. So then you can find in the top section after clicking here is a product. Then you have the archive. So click archive so that it will start archiving and this will take some time depends on the project size. Let's wait for complete archiving. Uh, if you have if it doesn't have any error or anything else, you can uh, get the archive succeeded at the end of this uh, archiving. After completing the archiving process, uh, you can find a pop-up over here from the Xcode itself. Here you find the project name and all these things. This is the archive history. And from there, you can find two options like a distribute app or else validate. So here I'm clicking the distribute application. So this method, first option is having the App Store correct, which means that if you want to upload it to the test flight or the App Store, you can click uh, and proceed it over here by clicking the next. And also after completing the process, it will ask the final button will be upload button. So here I'm going to development, choose here development, which means that I want to distribute to the members of the team. So I'm clicking this development and click next. Here is find option like app thinning. This will take some time uh, to uh, load it. And once it completed, you can click the next step, which means that you can make the options that are rebuilt from Bitcode and also strips if symbols uh, checked. Uh, if it is optional, whether you want to include this manifest, if not made, so you can leave unchecked. For time being, I'm, being, I'm leaving this at unchecked and click next. Here I can find the distribution certificate. Uh, you can select here and the professional profile. I'm going to select the profile valid profile. You can download this profile and also the certificate from the Apple developer account as I mentioned earlier. So after this, you can click next. So here is this process. Uh, this is compiling all these things. So this is preparing an archive for distribution, which means that it, it will be final product will be an IPA file. So once you get the IPA file, you can uh, we can or uh, you can make a URL for the distribution uh, for the valid devices. After preparing the archiving, you can find the final pop up over here with the project name and all these things and you have have the export option. Before going to that, one thing I forgot to mention is if you're before taking the uh, archiving, uh, if it is in the device, it's OK. Otherwise, uh, try to take in the build if you are pointed to the simulator. Just select this uh, build option and then you can select the archive option in order to start the process. So of here I have completed the archiving. So next is I'm going to export this build so that it will be a folder option. You can save it uh, a build option like so I'm going to name it something like a build 2.9 and I'm going to save it in my desktop. You can save wherever you like. I'm saving it here all right so next is I'm going to the uh, browser I'm going to check for uh, DIAWI this URL I'll be providing in the VD description this is a source uh, which you can create uh, the distribution link for the uh, who what on device you have added in the Apple uh, that will be supported if you uh, create this URL and uh, share it to your development team the important thing you need to follow is uh, you need to add the device in that professional profile whenever you need to add you need to update that and download the professional profile and add it to the X code all right so now I'm going to 
drag and drop over here so let's let me check for this uh, this is the build uh, folder which we created now and here you can find an option which is the project name and the IPA file so make sure it's an IPA file and you just need to drag it over here and this source actually uh, is available uh, only for the if the application is uh, less than 50 MB if it is more than 50 MB you can uh, choose the app box uh, in, uh, for the distribution if it is less than 50 MB this is fine uh, you can it's very easy so once it's done uploaded you need to click the send button so it will be processing and finally you will get an URL so you need to copy this URL and you can share with the development team so that the device which is added in the professional profile will get uh, they can install and uh, test the purpose so that's all in this video thank you for watching